Hey, you guys, it's your girl, Scorpio Jewel here. We're about to hit us, hit you guys with another random roll the dice reading. How this goes is I'm going to roll these dice, and whatever number comes out is the sign that's going to get red, okay? Um, everything you need to know about me is in the description box. Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. We are dealing with nothing but energies here. No gender. Okay. Anybody can embody any of the mask can be masculine or any feminine trait or sign at any time. We all have all the signs in our chart. Some just more prevalent than others. Okay, so with that being said, let's jump right into it. Okay, 10. That's gonna be Capricorn. Okay. Uh, cappy, cappy, cappy. All right. Five and five. Okay. Ten. Completions. Let's see who we rolling with. Kippa. All right. What's going on with the Capricorn, baby? How y'all feeling out fire or Capricorn? Or oh, Cappy, Cappy, Cappy. All right, what's going on? There are no reversals in this deck. Kipper deck, okay? I'm going to read. I'm going to get the spread out. I'm going to read what I got. And then I'm going to clarify. So the story may or may not change. Got to follow through. Hang in there. I may or may not call out the signs, you guys. Don't get hung up on that because, like I said, we all have them in our chart and we can embody any sign at any time. Okay, some is just more prevalent than others. Okay, so the first card out we got is bereavement. That's the number 19. That is breaks down to the number 10, which is the major arcana of the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. So, what's the next one? Capricorn, okay. So we got a journey. That's the number 10 as well. Breaks down to the number one, which is the fool. No, the fool is zero. Hold on. Yeah, the fool is zero. Yeah, the fool is zero. Yeah, the fool is zero. The magician is number one. Yeah, hold on now. Let me get it right and get it tight for you guys. Okay. Can't be calling the wrong thing. I like with I like messing with the numbers. Okay. I like number numerology and angel numbers and things like that. Here we go. Messages for Capricorn. Bereavement. A journey. What's coming up? What's the next card? What's coming up next? That's a corn. Messages for our lovely Capricorn. Okay, what's coming towards you, Capricorn? Here we go. What's coming towards Capricorn? There we go. And like that's the question right there. What's coming towards Capricorn? Can we not get the message? Bereavement. This is sadness, sorrow, loss, and death. Here, the end of something, a journey, a trip, somebody going somewhere after the end of something. Now, let's see what's going on here. What's going on, Capricorn? I like jumpers. The only way I, the only time I don't get jumpers is if I'm told to grab a card. Other than that, I keep shuffling until I get my jumper. Unless it's otherwise. Okay. Capricorn. What's going on with you, baby? You don't want to talk about it? Main person. That is the number two. Major arcana of the high priestess. Let's go. Capricorn. Spit it at. It's like I always had trouble with y'all. 
Y'all don't be wanting to come. Y'all don't be wanting to pop back. Thank you. Oh, that was an attitude right there. You saw that attitude. Okay. The marriage card. That's the number three. That's the Empress. Ooh, 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 ooh. What's going on, Capricorn? Come on, let's talk about it. Let the people know what's going on with you, though. Come on, now. Come on, now. I've been shuffling for a long time. This is a lot of stagulation, procrastination going on here. Sir, ma'am, bruh, sis. What's going on? It's like pulling teeth with you, dog. All right. Fine. High honors. That is the number 25. Breaks down to the number seven. That is the chariot. Then we got military person, the number 22. Breaks down to the number four, which is the emperor. Then we got his thoughts. That's the number 16. And that breaks down to the number seven, which again is is which is the uh what did i say because i was looking at this military person over here um that is the number seven breaks down to the chariot once again okay all right so what we got here bereavement a journey main person marriage card high honors military person his thoughts okay so what it looked like here capricorn is that so the question was what's coming towards you darling okay so what it looked like um it was an end of some sort we're gonna clarify and figure out what that's all about it was an ending and somebody is trying to take a little trip over here to you, darling. Okay. They got marriage on the mind. This is a person that you've known from your past. But you've known this person for a long time. Okay. You think very highly of this person. And you want to make something official with this person right here. You was heading over there. They is heading over there to you. Now, I'm sorry. This is what's coming to us. You, Capricorn. Okay. So, yeah, and they come about that business, and that's all the thoughts that's on this person's mind. And it says his thoughts, and this main person has got a lady right here and everything like that. But like I said, we are dealing with energies here. So, this could be a man as the main person, and this could be her thoughts, okay? We're dealing with energy. Okay. So, what is this bereavement, darling? Okay. Yes, 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 yes. And it breaks down to the number 10, the Wheel of Fortune, okay? But evidently, that Wheel of Fortune is upside down. Upside down. Oh, turn me inside out. Somebody not happy about the ending of a situation here, okay? That is too many cards, okay? What's bereavement for Capricorn? What's coming towards Capricorn? What is bereavement? All right. Yep. Five of Swords in the upright. The lovers in reverse. There was a breakup here. Okay. Now, the lovers can be real life lovers, you know, relationship, you know, romantic relationship, or it could be. A relationship that is broken apart, you know, friends, family members, okay? Somebody that you've known for a long time that you got love for, okay? Don't necessarily have to be boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, 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 husband, husband, boyfriend, boyfriend, girlfriend, girlfriend, okay? Don't necessarily have to be that, okay? So some situation, whatever you've been in, uh, Capricorn, you broke up from this person here, okay? That was some... Some um, lies and deceit here, which caused said breakup with this five of swords. Okay. 
Nah. Now, either you moved on, Capricorn, or somebody is coming towards you. But this, the question was, what's coming towards you? So, somebody, after you done broke up with them, or they done broke up with somebody or whatever. Okay, y'all know y'all eat. And they coming towards you, dog. It's a journey. Eight of Swords in reverse. There ain't a doubt in their mind. Their mind is made up. They are not going back and forth. In this, in their head, they are no longer in mental prison. Okay, they are not trapped by thoughts of negativity or anything like that. They have made a decision. They have broken free of the mental shackles, and they have decided to come towards you, Capricorn. What we got going on? Her. Give me more for the journey. Please and thank you. Last night I could barely even talk for Leo's. I don't know what was going on with my voice. But thank you. The start. Yo, darling. They got hope for it, Capricorn. They see. They like, yes, I'm going. There go my baby. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, they got a hopeful zoo, darling. They hopeful for a success in the reunization of said relationship. Okay, main person. Why they out there hollering like that? Forgive those folks outside. Pay them no mind. Listen to me, I say. Okay, who go? Main person. Page of Wands. Oh. Page of Wands, Nine of Swords. Now, when they get there to you, baby, they worried about what's going to happen to her. This might be a proposal coming up here with this marriage card over here at the next. Look at it, because they worried about whatever they come to do to say to you, Capricorn. They nervous. They worried. Mm-hmm. <laughs> This is nice. What is he? Somebody look it. And then uh, the man on the thing right here is on his knee. You know what I'm saying? Bending down on his knee. Somebody about to get Capricorn. Somebody about to propose to you, dog. And they nervous as shit. But they hopeful, goddamn. Ooh, bitch. <laughs> come on. What's marriage card? What's this? Oh, come on. There we go. Let's get it then. Shit. Oh, Lord have mercy. Four of swords in the upright. Three of swords in the reverse. Oh, my goodness. So, this is, this is, this is, this. Okay. I see what's happening here. Okay. So, they want to come over here and holler at you, Capricorn. You know what I'm saying? Give you this young here marriage proposal. And they hoping that you think about it or, and that, you know, that you think about it and contemplate on it. You know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, they hope that you over the heartbreak, the betrayal over here from when y'all broke up right here. Okay? They hoping that you over it. They hoping, oh, look at that. And they, they oh, my goodness. Here we go. This, there we go. Mm-hmm. Justice in reverse. Yeah, they hoping that, uh, look, bitch, now you want to talk about it. Now they want to talk about it, Capricorn. This was coming towards you, baby, okay? Look, yes, they hoping they, oh my goodness, they hoping that you over the injustice, the betrayal, the third party situation here. They hoping that you over it. This got them, what, oh shit, Capricorn, somebody coming through for you, darling. Hi, honors, okay? Shit. Okay. Look at this here right here. And this dude right here, male or female, this person right here, look at them. They getting all ready in the mirror and shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, my goodness. Look at this shit. High honors. We got a good reading here. We're going to see. We're going to get an outcome for this one, dog. We're going to see what happens here. 
You know what I'm saying? It might be for some of y'all. You know what I'm saying? Not all of y'all. Okay? Don't be running around here taking no damn cheetah back and forth. You know what I'm talking about? They ain't changed their damn ways and everything like fuck. Okay? So, but we gonna ask all them questions because what the fuck you coming over here for and how are you coming? You know what I'm saying? Oh, I just heard, too, they coming humbly, too. You know what I'm saying? With this page of wands. You know what I'm saying? They ain't even coming in King of Wands energy because they know they can't be big-headed and shit like that. They got to come like, hey, how you doing? How your mama and them doing? <laughs> how honest? <laughs> Here we go. Uh, nine of Wands in the upright. That's the wounded warrior right there. Giving it one more damn shot and every damn thing like that. You know, uh, you know, you lost some battles and you, you, you still ready to pick it on up, keep on going here. You know what I'm saying? This is not giving up. Just keep going right here. Okay, nine of wands. What we got? Oh, shit. Now, what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Give me some more for uh, how honors. Right. Somebody, they hopeful too. They hopeful and they worried at the same damn time. You know what I'm saying? They hoping. Please let this person be over the bullshit that I have done here. Don't you see that I love you? <laughs> oh, Lord. Even though I don't see that on the board. I don't see no love here, baby. Oh, Lord. I really don't. I see a record. Somebody wanted to come on back, though. Somebody wanted to spend the block. That's what I see. I don't see no love here, though, Capricorn. Be mindful of that now, baby. Okay. We ain't got no cups on this board. Okay? Mm -mm, that's all I'm saying. Uh, we got this wands and swords. Okay? M mental and physical. Okay? Tower in reverse. Mm-hmm. Yep. They are hoping to avoid a catastrophe right here. They are hoping for things to be successful around here. Let's see here. Thank you. Let me get them two right there. High Priestess in the upright and the Page of Swords in reverse. Now, what I'm getting off of this here, Capricorn. Now, we started off fresh and good. And just like I said, I don't see no cups on this board right here. You know what I'm saying? So, um, it's like womp, womp, womp right here, right now. Okay? With this high priestess right here. Now, this is you, I believe. This high priestess right here. This person is hoping that you don't see the lies. You know what I'm saying? Page swords in reverse. High priestess, page swords in reverse. You see a liar here. They're hoping that you don't see them as a liar. That's what I'm getting here. That, all right. That's, that's what I'm getting right here. Okay. Because they want you to, you know, one more shot. And they're hoping not, that it's not going to be a catastrophe right here. You know what I'm saying? They're trying to avoid a catastrophe here with high honors. You know. This is recognition. They want you to see them in a certain light. And they don't want you to see them as a liar. Okay. So that's what's going on here. We still ain't got no cups on this board, though, Mike. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. You see them, Capricorn. They spinning the block for you, baby. Yes, they are. But there is no cups on this board. Military person. Okay? Five of cups in the upright. Uh-uh. Now, this military person, this is a person, you know, they might be in the military, but they are a person of authority. You know what I'm saying? A person of um, dignity. You know what I'm saying? Uh an upstanding individual, you know, people in the community look at this person as, you know, 
you know, um, I don't want to say official person because official person is in here and it's something totally different. Let me look and see. Military person. Hold on. Right here. Right. It represents a person that wears uniforms and their profession, such as a police officer, firefighter, customs officer. You know, they wear symbolic work clothes, such as white coats and doctors or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this card has the quality to emphasize and underline a fact that shows the card's layout. It tells you this particular manner is to be expected. This card represents security, stability, and order, or it stands for the need for security and order. Okay. Now, military person is clarified by the five of cups. And the devil, goddamn, mm -mm -mm. in the upright. Huh. This person is coming back to you for stability and security, Capricorn. They sad. They got an unhealthy att attachment to your ass. That's what I'm saying. That's what they coming back for. I don't for 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 for, for mental shit. Cause all these swords on here and all these wands. This is sex and mental shit. You know what I'm saying? Like um. And wands is stability. You know what I'm saying? Fucking uh, swords is too. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, oh my goodness. Come on, let me see one more thing here. Let me get one more card for this uh, military person. The moon in reverse. Yes, that's why they're coming back, man. Because they need stability they need security. They lost out here without the kid. Okay, that's what it is, Capricorn. You see me? Because I don't see no cups on this board. Ain't no love here. They see you as being stable or whatever. You stable. You secure. You got your shit going on. This is the last card, okay? Because it just popped out for this military person. Five of Pentacles in the upright. Yes, they ass is out in the cold, broke, busted, and disgusting. They, this is this just a turn to the work. I, don't. <sighs> Moving right on along. Yeah. The truth of the matter is they out here hurting and hurting out here in these streets. Capricorn. That's why they coming back here. Like I said, it ain't no love on this board. This motherfucker finna bring they ass, male or female, finna bring they ass around this corner to you, Capricorn, and try to propose to you. You see this? And try to propose to you. <laughs> like they really love your ass and shit. And they don't. They just want to be, they just want to be with you because of what you get and what you can offer and what you can do to them. They are attached to you. They codependent. That's what it is. This motherfucker. Oh my goodness, what is his thoughts? This is probably finna be the banger right here. Irritate my soul. I was happy. I was hmm. okay. His thoughts, please. Number 16 breaks down to the chariots. What is his thoughts? <laughs> his or her thoughts. These are energies, okay? It could be a female and her masculine, or this could be a man. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, but look at this sneaky old bastard. Come on. Yes, Ten of Cups in reverse. Lord. This is what a person is thinking, okay? They unhappy, they unfulfilled. You know? What's going on? What's going on with his thoughts for Capricorn? This is what's coming towards you, baby. Prepare yourself. Okay. If it don't apply, let it fly. I did not say that in the intro. Okay. Knight of Cups in the upright. Well, we got a cup. We got a cup. It's a knight, though. We got a cup. We got a cup. It's a knight, though. It's 
going on? What's going on for Capricorn? What is this person thinking? What is his thoughts? Okay. Okay. Ace of Cups. In the upright. Knight of Pentacles. In the upright. Okay. Death in reverse. In reverse. Now we got some cups on the board. Okay. Because baby... Okay. Yeah, this person is unhappy without you, Capricorn. You know, they want to come to you. They got a little bit of money, a little bit of love. They want a whole new start of love right here with this Ace of Cups here. Okay? They hoping that you don't see them as a liar here. You know, they don't want this to be over with for good. Okay? At least we got some cups on the board because I was pissed. Little bitch. <laughs> Let's see. Now, what was I saying earlier? I said we is going to see. We're going to get an outcome. Okay? One more card. Should I use a kipple? Yeah, I'm going to use a kipple. Okay. Uh, see, you, you know what? This person, they do got love for you, Capricorn. See, but the thing is, like I said, they, they it's an unhealthy attachment, though. You know, it's unhealthy because with this devil right here, they probably they got some toxic things going on with them. They probably got some addictions or whatever. You know, they this is depression here. This person is unstable, military person. You know, this person is unstable. You know, they hold a certain uh. A certain stature or uh I'm, i don't want to say label what is it and it's not persona what is it a certain um shit uh, you know um oh my goodness what else you know a certain character a certain persona a certain um image you know they they got a certain um reputation you know what i'm saying yeah yeah yeah, yeah. they got a certain reputation okay that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> they got a certain reputation out in these streets here. Okay. But this is depression. Okay. Five cups. No. This is depression. This is sad. They're probably drinking and drugging. Drinking and drugging and slitting in public. Nobody knows it. Okay. No. The moon's in reverse. Everybody knows it. Okay. <laughs> Everybody knows it. They hurting for certain, okay? Out in the cold and everything else like that. So that's another reason why they're coming back to you. Because they can't get their shit together without you, Capricorn, okay? They are not stable without you, okay? This is the outcome that just fell out on the page of swords that's in reverse, okay? We got great happiness, bitch. Ow! <laughs> that is the number 26. Breaks down to the number 8. The strength. So, this leads me to believe before I clarify it, that it is going to take great strength for this thing here to work on X. That's what it's looking like to me, dog. Okay? So, what's great happiness? Okay? Joy and pain, sunshine and rain. You got to take the ups with the downs. That's what they had said. Okay. Mm -hmm, the good with the bad. Hopefully, whatever this person did to you, Capricorn, is not that is is not bad enough that, you know, they can't come back from it. Okay. But they are hoping that you are over said injustices and everything like that. You know what I'm saying? And betrayal, heartbreak, whatever, lies, deceit, whatever, whatever happened. Y'all know what happened, okay? Y'all know what happened. It's y'all relationship. Okay. Here we go. Great happiness. Clarify great happiness, buddy, for the outcome. Because clearly Capricorn person does not want this to be over with. They are coming. They nervous. They hopeful too at the same time. 
They come in humbly too, this page of wands. Yes, they are. You need to get some confidence about themselves. Here we go. The sun. Ooh, I was nervous. <laughs> First, my goodness, I don't even know. So, yeah, this is a new beginning. This is a great start. You know what I'm saying? So, it's just going to take a lot of work, Capricorn. Are you willing to put in that work? The choice is yours, darling. Everybody's situation is different, okay? So, just a little recap right here, okay? You broke up with your person, Capricorn, okay? They was lying, cheating, stealing, doing whatever they was doing here. It was some deceitfulness going on here, all right? So you broke up. Love is in reverse. This person is coming towards you. Journey. Okay? They've made their man up. They're not going back and forth in their head. They ain't got no mental prison. They're not, you know, mentally uh, uh, misconstrued and everything. The man is made up. They're coming towards you, and they're hopeful. They are hopeful. Okay. They're looking forward to this year shit. Okay. Stop. This also is a new beginning as well. They're hoping for a new beginning, a new start. They're hoping that, you know, you, Capricorn, you're the main person here. Wheeze you, wheeze, or oh, wheeze you ain't my baby. And so they're finna come and whisper something in your ear right there. They ain't coming all big headed and, and everything like that. You know, they ain't got, they got look, they ain't got much confidence, but they come. You know what I'm saying? They worried about it. They stressed about it. What what the, what the choice you gonna make there? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They hoping that enough time to pass. Four swords in the upright. Marriage card. Okay. They hoping that a m much time then went past and you didn't got over the heartbreak, betrayal, the injustice, and the third party situation here that occurred. Okay. Then, like I said, this is a proposal right here. I, I see this as a proposal. Okay. So here they come. They want to give it one last shot here. And they want to give it one last shot here. All right. They want to avoid a disaster. You know, they really want to avoid a disaster. Because like I said over here, they worried. They hopeful, but they worried at the same damn time. They hope that you really still got some love for them, Capricorn. Okay. And they don't want you to see them as a liar. You know, they don't want you to see them as a liar. You know. All right. So then, so like the, like the book had said over here, the need for security, okay, depending on the cards that's around in this fight. This person is unstable and, you know, and insecure and everything like that, you know. Uh, they need security, stability. You feel me? They are unstable, and, um, and um, what am I saying? They are unstable and um, not insecure. Yeah, insecure, unstable. Yeah. So they sad and depressed. You know what I'm saying? With this devil right here. Like I said, they probably drinking and drugging and everything like that. You know what I'm saying? Behaving out here bad. Dealing with their sorrows in the toxic manner here. Everybody knows it. It's not a secret anymore. Moon in reverse. You know, if this person is, they, you know, that they left out in the cold. You know, by you. Probably by everybody else too. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, because everybody knows. So anyway... Now you got his thoughts. This is what this person thinking about. Male or female, okay? They, they thinking about how they unhappy, how they unhappy here. They are so unhappy. This is unhappiness to the 10th power, okay, buddy? Shit. They want to bring you this medium-sized love, okay? This medium-sized cup of love, all right? It wasn't the king of cups. It is the knight of cups. They got some, they got some love for you. You know, you in the medium right there. <laughs> but you got the Ace of Cups. So, you know, that 
actually, you know, that big upset right there. You know what I'm saying? They really want to start this thing over and start a new thing. With you. So you might as well, you could jump that on up there to the King of Cups with that. The Ace of Cups with the, with the Knight of Cups. You could jump that on up there like that. Add it with the Knight of Pentacles, you know what I'm saying? You got a little money, she got a little money, you know what I'm saying? Bring a little something to the table when they come through. You feel me? Okay? They just don't want this to be over. Death in the reverse. They also, this is also, uh, no, uh, if it was upright, it'd be that. But they don't want to be over with. So, then we got great happiness for the outcome. And the sun is clarifying it, baby. This is beautiful right here. Way to go, Capricorn. So, the choice is yours, dog. Okay? That's what I got for you, baby. The choice is yours. You know what I'm saying? I love it. I love it. I love it, though. This person, they coming, though. You know what I mean? They hoping that you didn't, you know, they hoping that you didn't got over every damn thing else like that. Don't see another lie no more. They fucked up out here, though. This this row right here is fucked up. You know? But like I said, we got some cups on there. You know what I mean? So there. And then the outcome right there is the great happiness and the sun. Okay? So this, hold on now, dog. I just heard for who, though? <laughs> That's what I heard. For who? <laughs> who is the great happiness in the sun for? Is this for them or you? Will you be happy or will they be happy? Ooh, look at that, look at that, look at that. Who, who is going to be happy here? We're going to get this. We're going to get this. All right. Look. Page of Cups, Seven of Wands. They will. Because they got the cups right here. And they coming towards you and everything right here. We got the page cups right here. You know. And the seven of wands. And like I said, it's going to be some hard. It's going to be hard work. It's going to take some strength right here. Seven of wands. It's, you're going to have to fight for it. So they'll be happy. They'll be happy. And is you going to be happy, Capricorn? Damn it. Hold on. Shit! <laughs> the devil came out. Yo. Mm, mm, mm. Damn. And we got the devil on the board two times. Keep it real with you, Capricorn. It looked like this person, yeah, they're, oh, damn, I should have ended it right there, man. I just really want to know who's going to be happy and everything. Damn. <laughs> How can I look at this? Can I look at this any other kind of way? Who gonna be happy in this? And it could also be that you need to keep your guards up against this person, this page of cups person. And like they the devil here. You, you could look at it like that because you got the, this is them. Cups here, cups here, cups here. Could be that you need to keep your guards up against this person. They toxic. Like they would give them great happiness. You know what I'm saying? To go ahead and get back with you. Let's get some more. Because this just a... Mm. Damn. Mm. Well, damn. Let's see. Um, I 
We're going to go, what's this devil? Who this devil? What's, what's going on with this devil right here? Hold on. Not, not the careful. What's this devil? We're going to get this devil in this page of cups. We're going to clarify all these fuckers. Because what the hell? Mm -mm -mm. I was happy. I should have just left that where it was. But them folks said, who going to be happy though? <laughs> mm -mm. Damn. Do y'all see that? Okay, we're going to go seven of wands first. We're going to go left to right. What's the seven of wands? What's the seven of wands? Seven of wands, seven of wands, seven of wands. Damn, Capricorn. I was happy. I'm like, who's going to be happy? I was hoping that, you know, I was hoping that like the two of cups came out or something, you know, in the upright. So it would have been like both of y'all, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Or Ace of Pentacles or something, or the world or something, you know what I mean? Like, but something like that would have came out. God damn it. Damn, seven of wands and a page of cups. That flat out, that just, um. Yeah, that means that they going to be happy and you need to keep your guards up against this person. Because they the devil. Because the devil right here. Why am I clarifying it? Why am I clarifying it? Clearly, seven of wands, page of cups, the devil. That's the devil right there. You got the cups right there. You just now need to keep the guards up from, from, from this person. Here, yeah, Capricorn. They devil. They unhealthy. They toxic. You know what I'm saying? And then with this page of cups right here, with this little funky ass fish in there, they coming with this on you know, this knight of cups shit like they gonna give you big love and only gonna give you this little ass cup with this funky ass fish in it. With they de devil ass. I'm mad now because like, mm mm. I'm steady shuffling these cards. I ain't finna get nothing else out of here. Because that's the story right there. They ask to be happy. They get what they want. But you're going to be tied to their ass. Hold on. Hold on. So. Because forget this. What in the what? I wants to make sure. Because this is just the same. If Capricorn do take this person back, what they got? You know what? Nah, we don't even hold that damn deck. That's what we gonna do. That's what we gonna dang on do. We just hold that deck. You hear me? Now, if Capricorn take this person back, what they got coming towards them? What they got? King of Swords. What is, what is it? King of uh, Capricorn, take this person back. What's the outcome if they take him back? We see the outcome over here. It's the goddamn devil. <laughs> it was such a good reading, though. <laughs> it was such a good reading. I'm like, no. Dang it, it fell on the flow. Oh my goodness. Queen of Pentacles. Ain't no reversals in this deck either. Does Capricorn take them back? What's going on now? What's the outcome if they take them back? 
So that's why we got the King of Swords and the Queen of Pentacles. One more card, please. And the tower. <sighs> Shit, man. Well, we tried, y'all. I was hoping that this was going to be a good outcome, so then I could say, well, this is for some of y'all, and then this is for some of y'all. But, yeah. <laughs> you need to stay on away from here, Capricorn, okay? Need to keep this here person away from you, okay? Because this right here, this right here is you guys. This is the towel. Okay? Now, it could be a disaster, or it could be just something that just happens very quickly. Let's, let's keep going. I got faith in some of this. God dog, man. You know, let's see what's happening here. Okay, my ears ringing now. Oh, my goodness. Stop it now. We got the King of Swords. And, okay. All right. Ace of Cups and the King of Cups. It's, yeah, okay. Okay. Now, this can go either one or two, this can be one or two ways here. Now, this could just be a surprise, okay? It don't necessarily have to be something devastating, okay? This could be just like a surprise or, you know, or it could be something devastating. You got to look at the cards that's around you, okay? So, we got the King of Swords to the Queen of Pentacles to the Tower, Ace of Cups, King of Cups. It looked like, because we got all of these, all of these swords on the board, and these pentacles. That's one pentacle, one pentacle. Okay. Look like this person might just shock the hell out of you. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a progression here, from knights and things to kings and queens. Because remember I said earlier, ain't no cups on this board and everything like that. Okay. We didn't jump all the way up to the King of Cups. Ace of Cups on the board two times. Okay. Knight of Cups right here to the King of Cups. Now look. They might just shock the shit out you. You know what I'm saying, Capricorn? You know? And you both be dang on happy around here. Some of y'all need to keep your guard up around this person. They're full of shit. They're the devil. They're still in that toxic energy. Another one of y'all that's going to work out just mighty fine here. You know what I'm saying? That's what I was hoping for because I just did not want it. It was so good at first. And, you know, so, yeah. You know, this person is determined, you know. They determined to, like, they're going to shock the shit out of you with their turnaround here. Because this is stability right here. This person is about their business, about their money and everything like that. This is determination, focus, drive, and everything else like that. That's this person here. They're going to shock the shit out your ass. Give you some, some, and show you some love here. This Ace of Cups. This is overflowing love. King of Cups can be male or female, okay? They're going to shock the shit out you, all right? So, for another group of y'all, you know y'all, you know your situation. Not one group of y'all need to keep your guards up. 
Stay away from this person. They, they the devil. Another group of y'all, this person has really changed their ways. You know, and um, you know, and they gonna it's gonna shock the hell out you with this towel right here. You know, and um, they're gonna give you all the love that you've been looking for right here. Ace of Cups, King of Cups. Okay. But like I said, this person is coming humbly to you. You know what I'm saying? Right here, you know, with this Page of Wands, this Knight of Cups and Knight of Pentacles. You know, they expressing they expressing this love. They probably got a a a weird a a, a hard way of like expressing emotion and everything like that. You know what I'm saying? Because this is how they could be on the outside with this Knight of Cups, but on the inside they on this Ace of Cups thing. You feel me? You know, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end it right there, okay, because this is damn near out. But Capricorn, that's what I got for you. I appreciate y'all spending this time with me. Check out my daily affirmation, meditation, and crystal cards. I do them Monday through Friday, you know. Congra uh, congratulations to some of y'all, and um, stay dangerous to the rest of y'all, <laughs> okay? <laughs> ah. I love y'all. Thanks for spending this time with me. Um, if you want to schedule a personal reading, you know, the information is in the description box. If you'd like to donate to the channel, that information is also in the um, description box. So, yeah, this was a pretty good reading, Capricorn. I'm happy with it overall, you know. Happy for some of y'all and the rest of y'all. Stay dangerous, man. Fight, fight the fucking good fight. It's the devil on your back over here, all right? Okay. Much love to all of y'all. Have a great night or great day, wherever you may be at. I appreciate and love you. And thanks for staying the whole way through. Peace.